Now it looks like 50 Cent trolling done pissed off the usually quiet Stevie J. Now of course 50 is no fan of Diddy, but this time he's brought in former bad boy producer Stevie J into the mix. Now 50 took to his Instagram page to air out Stevie J over an alleged video where he was on camera sleeping with a man. Now he posted up a blog post that said, new documents show that Diddy allegedly used videos of Stevie J sleeping with another man to groom him into wanting to sleep with each other. And the horrible thing is it actually has a screenshot of it. Now in the attached court documents it indicates, Mr. Combe used access to Stevie J and his knowledge of Mr. Jones' admiration of Stevie J to groom and entice Mr. Jones to engage in being with a man. Now Mr. Combs went as far as to share a video of Stevie J busting open a white Caucasian male without protection. Now this was done to case Mr. Jones' anxiety concerning sleeping with dudes. According to Mr. Combs, this is a normal practice in the music industry. He said, look, even Stevie J is doing it. Now, Mr. Combs informed Mr. Jones that he had engaged in intercourse with other rappers. They took out the names and also an R&B singer and Stevie J. Now, Mr. Combs promised to make sure that Mr. Jones wins producer of the year if he engaged in sleeping with men. Now the following are actually screenshots of the video of Stevie J busting open a Caucasian male that Mr. Combs provided to Mr. Jones. Now the crazy thing is guys, he actually tagged Stevie J in the post. Now Stevie J immediately hopped on Instagram live and called out 50. Curtis, what's good man? You and your feelings about Daphne? Is she with gang them? Or is it that you sucking little Rod? How it go? I want you to fade, nigga. Fuck all that. Since it's entertainment, let me beat the shit out of you on TV or something. Don't duck that. I'm calling you out. What you want to do, Curtis? Curtis! Now, I know they both old and in their 50s, but we need some excitement in hip-hop. So, I'm going to need for them to pull up and throw hands and don't do this internet back and forth stuff we be seeing. I don't know about y'all, but I'm definitely here for the shits. Now one thing 50 don't do is play about his son Sire, but when it comes to his other son Marquise, his twin, he be like, fuck them kids. Now some information came out about Diddy having alleged ex-workers and Young Miami aka Porta Potty was named as well as Daphne Joy, another one of Diddy's piss pots and the baby mama of 50 Cent. Can't believe it. Now we know deep down he was hurt to find out his baby mama got exposed to the world them birthday parties for Sire gonna be looking real different moving forward. Look, I'm at the end of my rope and I wanna die. Unfortunately, baby mamas are still a part of your brand and I hate to say it, but they still kinda low-key represent you even if y'all just co-parenting, so I can see how this can be embarrassing for him. Now 50 wasted no time throwing shots at his baby mama, referring to her as a little ex-worker. But not sure why he's surprised honestly because she definitely gets around. Now according to US Weekly, he is now allegedly seeking full custody of their 12 year old son Sire. Now they reported given the latest developments and news of Daphne Joy's involvement in the Diddy lawsuit, 50 is going for sole custody of his son, a source close to the situation told US Weekly on Thursday. Now is it me or is this Diddy's list starting to look like the Epstein list? I mean, we got a lot of celebrities involved in his mess from Cuba Gooding Jr.'s zesty ass. Oh God, awful. And now multiple others. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this man. How do y'all feel about 50 Cent coming for Stevie J and also him wanting to get full custody of his son? Y'all let me know how y'all feel about this man. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on the videos. Share these videos and I'm gonna peep y'all on the next one. Holla. Can't get enough? Click on this screen to watch even more great content. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and you can also catch my clips on my other channel, The Lionel B Show Clips. And you can stream my audio on the go on Spotify, Apple Podcasts and all other major podcast platforms.